I believe in microevolution. There's something called macroevolution and something called microevolution. Now, microevolution is the changing of uh, environmental circumstances so that over generations, your 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 body, like you as a human being, yeah. are over generations or two or three decades able to adapt to that climate, right? That's called microevolution because. You went from like a, a hot Sahara area. In, yeah. And then you go. Yeah. So my bad. Uh, right. And then you go to like maybe um, somewhere that's cold like the Antarctica and you start living there. Over the time you're going to have Antarctica. like babies and everything. And then those children are going to be so adapted to the those those things. But at, eventually at that state, you're still human. You understand what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now what macro evolution is is they say every organism came from one organism okay now at first it was there was this organism it was like this base fish right so bacteria created this uh, organism uh, uh, I, can't, I can't get the name of it uh. yeah and then uh, the fish decided okay it needs to spread out and then as it spread out there was no food in certain areas so it decided to go to land and so they walked on land and things like that, and things like that, and then they change species. Boom, boom, now boom, that boom, I don't boom, believe. Boom, boom. I, I'm not sure if you if your two guys watch the Big Bang Theory. Yeah. The the starting jingle for the Big Bang Theory. Yes. Uh, uh, go on YouTube quickly and and, and check that out because it it dis- it describes what you're talking about, which is something which is amazing. Another thing uh, I know this happened a couple because of months let ago. me let me tell you this yeah because uh, this is how I'll prove this to you right. Why I believe in in microevolution, not macro. I don't believe you can change species. Jingle. You understand? You see, I don't believe you can change.